do you like the work you're doing as a husband? Why can't you stop what you're doing that is not right? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. How you all doing? I thank you for all my subscribers, my viewers, my returning subscribers, and my new subscribers. You guys are wonderfully made. Thank you so much. If you're meeting me for the first time, I'm happiness Adam. You're welcome. Please subscribe to my channel. So guys, in today's video, I want to be sharing with you guys the story that touches life. She refused to release my money because she's the one helping me to collect my money and keep my money. So guys, before I continue, let me introduce what I'm cooking today. I'm making Arab local chicken stew with white rice. Can you guys see how the chicken is small in size? Very strong and delicious. So let's dive into it guys. So guys, what really happened is that each time I collect my salary here, like two months, three months, I will send it to home. So my sister will help me to cash the money and change it and keep it for me. Normally, she's supposed to pay it to my account. But what happened to my account is that my children block my SIM card. So I can't be able to receive a lot. So I told them not to pay money there, you know. Nigeria with their wahala this time around, they have to send money where you see a lot. So my sister will be helping me to keep the little change that I have. But what really happened and why she refused to release my money is that each time I send her money, I send account numbers that she will pay money to guys. Then and she's not seeing it as a good thing and she's not she's telling me it's not funny. That how can I be sending some account number? Who are, who is all those people that I'm sending money? Then I told her that those people need my help, and I believe I'm in little position to help them. So that was the reason why I decided to help them. No amount is too small. She was like, it's getting too much. Each time I send money, I send account number. It's getting too much. Can you please stop this? I said you should leave it. That is my life. It's not her life. So this last one is that I I send her money and I send some account numbers. So immediately she called me video call. Who she normally you normally call me call, um, voice call, not video call guys. Then when I saw my sister video call, I was like, I hope all is well. The answer was the problem. She said she just wanted to talk to me face to face and ask me some questions. I said, what is that? She said, are you the one that sent this account number? So I said, yes. He said, who and who is this person? I said, you don't know them. They need my help and I can assist the little one I can do, guys. So she said, are you sure you're doing this with your clear eyes? I said, yes. And she asked me, this work you're doing, are you enjoying the work? How much is your salary? Why are you sending people money? Do you know that we, your family, need this money? I said, but I've been trying for my family. She said, if I believe I have money that I can send to people, they see this particular account numbers I send this period, she's not going to pay money on it. I asked her why. She said, yes, our younger sister needs money. She's going to give her all the money that I want to pay out. I was like, don't do that. It must not because of you came from a poor family not to assist anybody. Those people need my help and I promise them, give them the money. So I try to please her on my money. Try to talk to her senses. She was so annoyed and very, very annoyed with me, guys. But to go bit glory, after speaking to her senses and she listened to me, she have to pay money to the accountants I sent to her. So I told her, don't worry, let's keep our sister side first. We'll still do for her by the grace of God. So she was annoyed. Guys, she was annoyed. She said, if I send her, can I begin to send money? She's not going to send money to them. Look at my own working money. Somebody is helping me to tell me how to manage the money. I know his sister's love. I know it's a good heart. 
I know they fit for me because what I'm doing is not easy as a single mother, I know. But that does not mean that I cannot help person or I cannot help people, you know. That, that is not the kind of person I am. I hate seeing people to cry. I hate seeing people to suffer. But to God be the glory, we settled everything. So guys, why am I sharing this uh, conversation between me and my sister? Out here is that no condition is permanent, guys. If you're watching this video, you know I attach many videos where I'm working. They're also watching my videos and they're not happy. But they don't have choice because of the situation of a thing. But I can't just because I'm a husband. That I cannot assist people. Even before I work like a husband, I do assist people. Please, who say that I will listen to my voice notes? Because I decided to use voice notes to make this video, guys. If I'm in position to help, help. Give us never luck. I from my childhood, nobody gives me. I've not received gift from anybody. Up to today, I'm surviving, I'm still living. If they spare the work I'm doing, I'm still living. I'm still giving people. It's God I give us. The little way you know can help people. Please assist people. Do not allow the situation of your family or the poor family you came from or your family does not have to make you to like somebody who needs your help. Somebody that your help can survive to die. What will God judge you? And what will God tell you? Is it not God that give us the strength and power to do whatever to we are doing? Yes, some people may say that those ones you give doesn't mean they don't have money to work. Guys, let me be honest with you people. Many people wish to come and do this work we are doing as I'm speaking with you guys. But there's no single opportunity given to them. No way to come. The way situation is now, many wish, wish to do this work. Even more than this. So please guys, may God help us. And may we help those that we can help. Forget about your sufferings. Forget about the work you're doing. It's not permanent. We are better than many, many people outside there, guys. We are. And I talked to my sister. I talked to Sensi to my sister. Let her know that you're better than many people outside. No matter the situation you're facing today, it's not going to remain permanent. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and share, guys. Please and please subscribe to my channel and turn on your post notification bell so you can be notified each time I post a new video. From the bottom of my heart, I love you guys. I love all my subscribers, my viewers, my returning subscribers. See you guys in my next video. Yalla, bye.